group was formed in 1989. And at that time we were doing mainly roadside vegetation, creek restoration and, uh, in, and attempted to uh, form a green corridor between Sandy Creek and Kaiserstuhl National Parks. In 1995 we became aware that this old mining site at Altona was coming up for sale and we endeavoured to purchase it with funds that we'd raised. Heavy excavating equipment come in in the early days to move the millions of tonnes of earth and to reform the landscape, cover the uh, areas of, that had been used for excavation. They filled in all the washways and the pits and formed the land into gentle slopes. They did this very sensitively in that they were able to do it without really destroying very many trees. They were very aware of preserving as much of the original vegetation as possible. Uh, the Altona CSR Reserve and the adjoining heritage uh, reserves uh, form the Altona Remnant, which is uh, probably the largest uh, privately owned conservation uh, area outside the main conservation reserves. The group uh, has done a terrific job and continues to do a terrific job to, to maintain one of the, um, the, the big conservation reserves in the district. Since then, of course, there's been a huge amount of weed, weeding done. Uh, we've been able to eradicate most of the main weed species. But, of course, their present uh, occupation is in, uh, in keeping those weeds down and uh, taking out the regrowth from the seed base that's still in the ground. The weed control has been very effective. Uh, it's, it's been really, um, uh, it's just amazing uh, the, the results and, and it's also been the fact that the group has been so active in controlling any regrowth. This is an old uh, young olive seedling and it's nothing compared what we cleared when we came here. Some of them were 100 years old, but these seedlings keep on popping and they're our biggest threat because the seed source is quite, you know, it stays in the earth for a long time and birds keep on carrying uh, seeds in, foxes. So that's one of our biggest threats because if they come back, it wouldn't take long to uh, kill all the nat you know, nat natural native vegetation. Over the last 17 years, this small group, group of very enthusiastic volunteers have done a magnificent job in, mag uh, in managing this park for the council and for the community. They have made a significant contribution to restoring the native vegetation of, of the area. They have made big roads into animal and pest plant control. The biodiversity is there now. It's marvellous what a group of dedicated volunteers can do uh, if they're given the resources and the encouragement. And that's exactly what Brian Teske and this group of magnificent volunteers have done. If you'd like to volunteer and become involved in uh, this uh, wonderful project, uh, we'd be happy to uh, take you on board. Uh, it's always easy to catch uh, either myself or George Weiss. Our names are on the brochure that you will find at the container and also the Barossa Council can always put you in touch with us.